Okay, I'm using the free flash to video converter. And when that opens up, there are, okay, the, we have here add files, output name. Okay, I have switched it to the Swift format. It will let you go, it defaults to this until you set it to change to that. So if you use this application, make sure you change that format. Okay, now we want to add the file. I have it stored here. <coughs> we want to set the output name. We do not want to include the original. We're going to call this, no, we'll just include the original. Okay, we can change this and call this Diz2010. And okay, so now that what that's saying is it's going to be here's the directory wherever you want it saved to, browse to that, set the directory you want it to go to. Okay, I have tried several settings, and for this, the best possible setting is 480 by 360. So, um, we need to start the conversion. Already. Okay, when it's completed, it will, if you have this HTML, it will pop up an HTML page, but I didn't get that part recorded. Okay, this will open the folder where it is. Here is the file, and it will automatically open in my flash prior with Macrobini. I'm not sure how it will open on yours. But you can see that it's a nice quality conversion. And we have completed the step of converting our AVI file into a flash file.